Hello? Hello? Oh look, it's the one with the terrible voice actors again. Ow! That hurt. Damn, I better rewind. Why? Why what, what the fuck you need to rewind for this? Just be like, hey, you alright? What the fuck? Why is he covering her face? She got hit in the back of the head. Whatever. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Actually, you just fucked somebody over. That person is going to be like fined or expelled or some shit. Fuck that. Hell no. Hell no. We're gonna rewind. We're gonna rewind. A bump on the head that's not gonna do much to you is not as bad as breaking a window and getting your shit. No. No, I'm gonna look. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Not that good enough to warn. Shit. Boom, bitch! That Take hurt. a seat! You're already on a seat. I'm sorry. Wanna say starry asshole? Who are you? You're Zach, huh? Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Oh! Oh! Did you see that? Did you hear what that prick said? He didn't say sorry for one, and he telling me, to oh, fuck that. Hell no. Hell no. Come here. Okay. Can I warn you? Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. There we go. Now that's what I'm talking about. I you do not fuck with me. me. Suck a dick, bitch. Suck on that. What? 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 Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Yeah, and not the dude that was sending the emails with watch her face and getting the hot chick in trouble with. With the other chick that was also pretty hot. I always get a little giddy when I think about having my own room here. Cool. Alright. Let's get out of here. Can't wait to see what happens to that guy for being a dickhead. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Take a photo. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. I'm gonna get your ass fired. Assuming our dean isn't a dickhead. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. How will you grow a fucking spine, retard? Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and Dave. Fuck. Fine, 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 fine. Over the line. I could rewind and try something different. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got this. Wait, wait. What's going on here? Is she okay? Did I Is she okay? I didn't change this, did I? Nice. I'm gonna take a picture of this as evidence against him. Suck a dick, asshole. Suck a dick. What's, what's with the journal? Zoomed in. So, is there anything to do here? Got a new message? The more I text, the longer I take. On my way. Bye. Okay, I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all the cars. Wow, you're so deep, man. So deep, I can't see you. Come up for air. Happy birthday, Maxine. And that's not her name. It's Maxipad, man. It's Maxipad. We can't believe it's 18, been 18 whole years since you were brought to us. XO, what? She was adopted? Max, your principal sent me an email saying that you told some tall tales about the black... Well, honor student, is this true? The principal said this was a serious false charge and that he is worried you're telling stories. Call me ASAP so we can talk about this. Mama, mama, mama. Uh, so, our principal, not a dean, I guess, is... Are they bees? Oh, they're birds. They're birds. Okay. Fuck. 
So, our principal, fucking birds. Uh, he's a dickhead. We need to kill him. I, uh, I know I want to kill a lot of people, but I know people die in this game or something. So, I'm hoping it's all the people I don't like. Like this guy. So, don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Intervene. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Yeah, Excuse dick. Excuse us. This is official campus business. Excuse me. You shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey. Nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. Nice hair. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I like that one. I like it a lot. Yeah, David Dickhead. We're going to go with it. Fucking genius, Maxine. Genius. Not very crowded for a campus, is it? Even the dorm was kind of small. Am I finished? Is that episode one? Did I finish episode one? Squirrel sounded like a dog. So what happened with the tornado? I can't stand to see people being bullied. Why? You you fucking didn't give a shit back in the hallway. Is this her? I don't get oh, it. Oh, it's Juliet. How could Zach and Victoria do that to me? Hi, Juliet. Got your cunts. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry about Zachary. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexed Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. Fucking sourpuss Maxine over here. God damn. Smile at least once in your life. Fuck's sake. What's this? Tired? I wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Alright. Uh, where is this Warren and what does he want from me? Missing person. At least Rachel Amber has people who care about her. Oh, yeah, because you're still alone in this world, right? You're so unwanted. Nobody loves you. It's not like you get text messages every five minutes or anything. It's not like there's some yes, dude over here waiting for you. Over here. With his fucking hand around his junk. Hey. Are you even old enough to drive, dude? Look at this guy. Look at it, look at it. How old does this guy look? He's 14. We're two 14-year-olds. Infiltrating a, a fucking college. Mm. Thinking we're going to get away with some shit. Oh, oh, backstory. We need to make a backstory for this. So, so Maxine isn't actually a depressed chick. She's an undercover, like, like FBI agent Yo, infiltrating Max, the... Will you shut up? I'm fucking doing shit. Fine, fine. You fucking ruined it. You fucking ruined it. You happy? What you up, fucking Max? ruined it. How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. Don't hug me. No problem. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. Man, I saw that Victoria didn't take down that pic of you on Facebook. Major bitch move. What's wrong with the picture? She's standing there in the fucking pathway with her arm on her other arm just looking. There's nothing wrong. It's not like she came out of the shower naked or some shit and Victoria was like, clickety-click. No! 
Who gives a fuck? Oh, hey, look, I thought this chick is cool today. I took a picture. Who gives What the? I don't want to talk. Well, no worries. No worries, Warren. I took a sweet shot of Victoria I can't wait to share. Oh, score one for Team Max. It would be so karmic to see her ass clown face all over the interwebs. I guess she does deserve it for all the shitty things she's done to people here. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? I've been busy because I have no interest in you, dude. And I also unlocked the power to turn back time today. So, I haven't really had time. Get it? Get it? I could have had time. I could have watched it. But you mean so fucking little to me that I didn't even bother to use my powers. Oh, God. Yeah, Rejected. Really with class and life. Damn, girl. You had it like a year. For a week, I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Hell no! Hell no, do not watch that fucking film, man. It's like a snuff film. It's fake. It's fake. Although they did kill real animals in it. They like fucking ripped open a tortoise and tortoise or some shit. It's really fucked up. If you don't like real animal abuse, then don't fucking watch it. And I'm hoping that's 100% of the people watching this video. Uh, seen it? No fucking way. No thanks. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Yeah, you know what? If I watched a fucking film where where people were like fucking hacking to dead animals or people, it's, you know, a, a snuff film like, like the, the screwdriver snuff movie, and then I said it was funny. I'd expect somebody to say that I was an insensitive asshole also. Faster, pussycat. Kill, kill. Uh, I don't remember what you were talking about. <laughs> no, I was impressed you had faster, pussycat. Kill, kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I need to talk. I don't want to speak about it. Now see, this is this is a dilemma for me personally. Because I need to talk. It's the option I would like to go with. But I have no interest in speaking to Psycho Boy over here. And slash Pussy Bitch with his dirty 80 year old car. And on the other side, it's like I don't want to talk about it. But that's a very girl annoying thing that, you know, no offense girls, but it's something you say a lot when you want to talk about something and it's like, what, we're meant to, we're meant to like pry it out of you? I do not give a fuck. You give me an answer saying I don't want to talk about it, I drop it then and there. So I'm kind of, kind of, ugh, kind of uh, at a crossroads on what to get. I think I might go with this though. Yeah. I don't want to speak about it. This is kind of a crazy day for me. I mean, I literally think I'm going crazy. I may be a pest, but I'm a good listener. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal, now. Answer me, bitch! Shut the fuck up, you bitch. I told him the truth. What are you talking about? BOOM! I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Ooh, I'm shaking in my little stylish boots over here. I don't know what I'll ever do. I could call the police. Pfft. Well, we know he owns the police. We're going to take care of this ourselves. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh, man. You're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude. Piss off, pussy. Hey, 
Leave him alone. Nobody tells me what to do. Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore right in the bathroom. <gasps> yeah. Enjoy your eye patch, bitch. Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren. Go, go, I got this. Get in, Max. Why? The tree was stomp his head out. There now. Don't even try to run. Nobody. Nobody. Look at him. Who be afraid of that bitch? Have all the weapons you want. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing. I have no idea. Why are we lying to her? She saved her asses. Uh, either way, it's just a bullshit answer. I have no idea. I know he's a press card. And an asshole. Your friend really stood up for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No. No, it felt like a real city for artists. Big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Um. Only for Mark Jefferson. He was a pretty famous photographer in the 90s. I've always loved his work. Those that can't do, teach. I'm glad you found a good reason to come back. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Oh, damn. I wanted to, bullshit answer. Give me a break. Suck it up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliché geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Actually, she uses excuses on everybody, to be fair. I like Chloe. Chloe, you're a cool in my box. A badass, blue-haired, punk chick that can whoop someone's face. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Broken. Oh, man, are you serial? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. I smell dinner, man. I'm hungry. I'm gonna go soon. But I'd like to get episode one in one shot, you know? It'd be awesome. I'm really loving this game. I really am. It's probably one of my favorite games of 2015. It's the only 2015 game I've actually played, but it's one of my favorites. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. Everybody's so negative. You have to be happy. Be happy and grateful for what you got, motherfucker. And that's a nicer house than I got. I don't even got a stairs. I don't care. Duh. Aww. Oh, I like it. I love this room. Boobs, boobs. Oh, oh, it's Chloe and the chicks. It's Chloe and the chicks. different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step Fuhrer makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. 
Put on some music while I medicate. Oh. oh yeah, medicate. Yeah, sure, sure. I know what you like. I know why I'm up here. I can tell. Hell yeah, I'm all about that. Ugh. Ugh. Sorry, not for me.